Hi everyone, Colleen Miklas here. Today we are gonna talk about the home fact sheet. This is listed in the C. Miklas team listing packet under the KWGM home fact sheet. This is when you're taking a listing and you want to acknowledge and record all of the systems in the seller's home as well as the average utilities. You will get asked these questions from buyer's agents. So this form is nice to have. Now, you're not gonna use this on every listing, a lot of investors don't pay utilities and they don't know the ages of some of these items. So this form would not be used from an investor standpoint, but if you have a typical sale where a seller lives there and they have these, you wanna get these from the seller. So obviously you would type in the home address here and you would insert the year that the, how old the oven is, how old the range, microwave, so on and so forth. And then you're gonna get into all the, these are the kitchen appliances here. And then you're gonna get into everything in the basement. In terms of the furnace, the AC is gonna be outside, hot water tank's gonna be in the basement. If they have a water softener, a well pump, if they have a well on the house and you're not on city water. Do they know the age of the roof? By chance, the age of the windows. Uh, last time the electrical box was updated. Uh, is there a satellite dish on the house? And if so, when was it put on? Is there a security system? Is it leased, is it owned, and what company? Sprinkler system in the yard? Is there a fence? What type of fence? Is it vinyl, wooden, wrought iron? And then of course, if they have invisible fence and would the seller be leaving that with the house, okay? You're also gonna wanna make sure that you insert, insert the last time it was serviced. Really the only items we service are the furnace and air conditioner. I've never had people service other things unless it was broken, then they would put that. And then obviously you would put the brand name. Okay, whether it be a Kenmore, a GE, a furnace would be a Ream, Bradford White hot water tank, so on and so forth. And then at the bottom, you're going to want to install, excuse me, input all of the utilities. What's the gas company's name? Is it Dominion East Ohio? Is it Columbia Gas, Electric, First Energy, uh, Cleveland Water Sewer, or maybe it's Twinsburg Water, uh, Trash, if they have a trash company like WM or Rumpke, is internet provided, AT&T, DirecTV, uh, do they have cable? Phone is kind of null and void anymore. And then oil, which would be rare, but if by chance they have an oil well. What those average monthly costs would be, the most common is going to be what is the average gas, electric, water, sewer bills. So ask your seller what those averages are. You can input them in there. And then of course, if they have the phone numbers, but if not, they can just go online and hook their uh, accounts up too. This is nice to use as a supplement when you do take a listing besides your property disclosures, besides your lead-based paint, if it was built before 1978. This home fact sheet is very nice to have online so that as a buyer's agent, I don't have to call you and ask you all these questions, okay? So again, this is in the CMEC team listing loop and use this to your advantage when you need it.